the genealogy of Jesus it can be difficult to interest today's generation in some Bible stories. Occasionally, they seem so far removed from their everyday life. Likewise, in my younger years of study, I often thought, why did the writer include that topic in their script? Jesus' genealogy was one such story but perhaps, the reason for my questioning was because I didn't understand the message or its relevance. As I grew a little older, my own family grandparents and ancestors became of personal interest to me, where they lived and worked, the type of life they endured, their children and all the famous people I could be related to or the treasures I might inherit. I now know that the genealogy of Jesus was crucial evidence. It was the fulfillment of God's promise to the prophet Abraham that the Messiah, our Savior, would descend from him, Genesis 12:3, 22 18. Without such evidence, others could argue that Jesus was not the Messiah, the descendant of Abraham and David. Today, we can proudly refer to Jesus as the Son of God and the Son of David, the evidence of Jesus' family genealogy, going back hundreds of years, is well documented in Matthew and Luke's Gospel. Mount 1-2-17, LK 323-38, is my heart fully open to the Word of God and all its messages? Lord Jesus, thank You for the wisdom of our forefathers in sending Your Son to save us. May we always listen and respond to Your promises. St. Paul, guide all priests and religious. Help them realize that their actions speak louder than any words. Teach them to use their talents to convey God's message about, to rely above all, on the promptings of the Holy Spirit. Amen.